Good morning, everybody. Today, uh, <clears throat> I have prepared for you some telephone vocabulary, part one. Yeah, there is part one and part two. Today, it's a uh, part one. Uh, here are many <clears throat> of the words and terms we used to talk about telephones and using them uh, with example senses and special meanings related to landline phones, mobile phones, and smartphones. Uh, the first word is answer. Answer. Uh, to take the call and speak after a phone has rang. Please, teacher, can I answer my telephone? Teacher, please, can I answer? Answer. Of course, it's a verb. Can I answer? Uh, when someone calls me, I answer immediately. When I'm working, I don't answer. Okay, so answer the phone. We have an example sentence here. I phoned the shop, I phoned the boutique or the shop or the store, but nobody answered. So I guess they are closed. So I answer the phone. It means that when someone calls me, I answer. Answering machine. Answering machine, sometimes people are busy. So uh, when there is, uh, for example, you have a, a, a class, you don't like people to disturb you, so your phone is off. And if someone calls, please call after. Now I'm busy. After the ring, leave your message. Beep. Okay? So the answering machine helps you to record your message. And when the person you are calling to, you are sorry, you are calling, is going to answer you back. A recording device or a machine. A caller can leave a spoken message on it if they call if the their call isn't answered. Leave a message on the answering machine and I'll call you back when I can. So the answering machine is a service that can help people to call after when they are busy. Next one is busy or engaged. Uh, already been used uh, off uh, a telephone line or number. Uh, the line is busy. I want to contact my teacher. I want to call my teacher. Wait. Oh, the line is busy. The line is busy means my teacher is calling someone else at the same time. Okay. Beep, beep, beep. Mm, okay. So my teacher is, uh, my teacher's uh, phone is uh, busy. Uh, if the line is busy and you can't get through call uh, again later. Okay, then we have busy signal or engaged. Uh, busy signal or engaged, it means uh, the sound that you have if you are trying to contact somebody. Uh, it's clear, I think. Call, uh, call can be a verb and it can be a noun. <clears throat> uh, the act of telephoning somebody or someone or a telephone conversation. I'm sorry, but I really have to take this call. I have a call. I'm sorry. Someone is calling me. I have to take the call. Give me one minute and they come back. And the verb is call. Uh, teacher, please give me one minute. I want to call my mother. I think there is something urgent. Yeah, I want to call my mom. I want to call my daddy, for example. Yes, if you need a lift home, call me and I'll uh, come and get you. Uh, where you want and then we have caller of course caller is the person who calls uh, uh, my phone is ringing where is my phone i should see the caller i should see who is the person calling me who is the caller caller uh, the person who calls a telephone number i spoke to hundreds of callers every day when i was a receptionist for example uh, people who work on the in the uh, call center in the call center, your job is to call people every day. Okay, so you are a receptionist and the man is a caller. Caller. Charge or recharge. Every day you need to charge your phone. It's okay, and you need a charger because the charger is going to help you to charge your phone. To connect a smartphone, tablet, or computer, uh, digital camera, etc. To a charger. Don't forget to charge your phone before you go camping. Before I start work, I always charge my phone. I recharge my phone, of course, using a charger. 
Uh, then you have a conference call. You can call one person, so you call them and you finish. And sometimes, especially on WhatsApp, <clears throat> you can call two or three people at the same time. So you say, I am in the conference, <clears throat> sorry, I am having a conference call. It means I'm calling two or three people at the same time. Cordless phone. Cordless phone is a phone. It's a phone, uh, just an example, okay? It's a phone uh, you can use uh, to call and there is no cable. There isn't any cable. This is a, a cable. Cordless phone is a phone at home without a cable. It's not cell phone or smartphone. It's a cordless phone. So dial. I want to call my daddy, for example. I will take uh, my phone. I open uh, the password, sorry. Uh, okay, and then here we go. So uh, this is uh, my daddy. Okay, I'm going to go to repertory. I forgot, but I know his number. So uh, I'm going to dial the number. Dial is uh, 067, it's okay, and they continue. Okay, 6245. So okay, what I'm doing here, I'm dialing the number. Yeah, the number, the verb is uh, to dial. To press numbers on a landline or uh, a phone, okay, in general, it's a dial. Then we have dialing tone. Dialing tone, it's the music or the melody <coughs> the sound landline phone makes when you pick it up, okay? Uh, then we have hang up. Uh, uh, please, uh, I am having a class right now. Can you please hang up? I call you after. To hang up is to end the telephone call. Hang up, and then I can call you after. Uh, hotspot or Wi-Fi hotspot, it's a place, especially in uh, developed countries. I think there are also some in some uh, shopping centers, even in Africa and Asia. It's a place where you can find the Wi-Fi connection or a uh, network connection, and you can have it for free. It's okay. Uh, sometimes there is a password. Uh, sometimes you're asked to like some pages so that you can have access. A place where people can get internet or internet access either for free or by using a network access password. Then we have an uh, icon. Icon, this is a, uh, I don't know if you see my phone. This is an icon for Facebook. That's uh, an icon for a uh, camera. Uh, that's uh, uh, okay. That's an I. <clears throat> so these are icons. That's icon for Facebook. That's icon for okay. So there are different uh, icons I have for messages, for camera, for messenger over here for Facebook. Those are icons. Uh, it's a graphic symbol or picture on a smartphone or computer screen. Landline. Landline is the phone you have at home. Uh, this is a smartphone you can take with you when you go out and the landline it's always at home you cannot carry it uh, out a uh, line of connection is a telephone connection used to make a voice call clear a uh, missed call sometimes i am working when i finish i take my phone and i find 10 sometimes 20 sometimes more okay uh, missed calls those calls uh, I wasn't able to answer, I could not answer, so they are the missed calls. Uh, <clears throat> a mobile phone, cell phone, or feature phone, it's the phone you can simply take with you when you go out. And this phone, uh, it can be a cell phone. A cell phone, you don't have any connection, it's very simple. You don't have any Facebook, no WhatsApp, nothing. However, the uh, smartphone is a small is a phone with all those apps or applications. Uh, payphone. Finally, I finish with this one. Payphone or phone booth. It's a public telephone. You find it in public places, and you can make a phone call. And of course, uh, you you pay. It's a public telephone that takes coins. Coins. It's okay. Coins. Money. It's okay. Uh, one one euro or maybe one dirham, one dinar, okay, it's in a coin. Uh, or uh, a phone card payment for each call made. 
Uh, I uh, think uh, that's all for today. So I try to uh, help with some Arabic words uh, or some Arabic translations, uh, especially for those who are fighting and struggling to improve their English. If you have any questions or any comments, try to leave uh, them uh, here and I'm going to interact and they will answer you. Have a nice and a good day. Thanks for watching. Try to uh, like, like and subscribe. And of course, I will be waiting to see you again. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.